Hi folks, uh, we're back in Sable. Um, it's been a while, uh, but I realise I feel like I, I, I want to play some more of this. Um, so, I've got plenty of quests. Last time we, um, we got a quest involving going to get some poo. But I've just picked up a quest from the, uh, the mechanic here at, um, at the um, Seven Sisters station. And I'm going to go and speak to Ta Toto at the Crystal Plateau and to learn how to harvest crystals. First of all, I need to actually find my bike. It's around here somewhere. Still very much the night time, so everything's a bit gloomy. I think it's the night time. Maybe it's just the um, maybe it's just this biome. Right. Just want to know where we are on the map. We were there. We're now there. I think we're going there. Anyway, let's see what's over this cliff. It really is a cliff. <laughs> Ow! Bloody hell. Look at this, though. Ugh. Steam events. Steam event valley, this is. Actually, where am I going? I just realised I, I think I need to hang a bit of a left here. Just pass by the smoke. Hang on. Have we been here before? I don't think we have. Ah. We, we, we saw the whale, I think it was last time, where we just, we went through the middle of something. It looks like a ship that's got, what's it called, the Shadow... something? The Shadow of Neve. Just see if there's a way in. We're not sure what this, oh bloody hell, ooh. We're not sure what this is, whether it is actually a, a thing we can go inside or not. But it's very impressive. Very big. Making clangy noises. Ooh, that looks like a way in. Aha, I think we've... Ooh! Okay, things have just got a bit cliffular. Oh, it's okay. It's okay. Worrying unnecessarily there. I don't think I actually need to go all the way up. Find my way in... Ooh, God, it's all slippery. Find my way up here with any luck. This looks very, um... Climbable. Here we go. Uh-oh, I'm running out of stamina already. <laughs> That's fine. I think we can just about make... Oh, tits. What are you? Are you scrap metal, by any chance? Yeah, jump on it, that's right. Scrap metal, yes. And we can take that back to somewhere to um, turn it into something somewhere. Which is very important in this game. Ooh, more. There's a very small... A very small thing here. I wonder if that's a... Hang on, let's have a look. If this is a, a ledge where all my dreams will come true. It's not... Oh, that's how you get... A, okay. I can see, oh, I can already see a little um, slug cat, cat collectible up there, so I'm going to have a bit of a, a jump of who's. Oh god, I, I, ooh, I don't think I can get there at all. Not from here. Uh, this is, yeah, this is where I saw how to get in. That's where I thought we were going to get in, but this looks like um, all part of the navigation puzzle. Oh god. Okay, so we're up in the air now. It looks like, it looks like that's where we would have come in, possibly? I don't know. Okay, hang on. The sh oh, we are officially now in the shadow of Neve. Look at that over there. How do I get there? Hmm. It looks like there may be some aspect of having to switch something on down there. And there's a lot of... Th Look, there's a battery down there. I'm going to I'm gonna have to do a, a jumpy poo as a thing. There's a battery right here. Let's place that into here. And there's a way up there. Um, I'm going to go back to that battery in a bit. I'm just having a look. Now, there is that slug cat there. Jump egg! That's what the bloody things are called. There's another battery up there, though. I don't know why, something, something's getting very, um, cubular. Actually, this is very, um, this is very Zelda. It did not push me. <laughs> I expected it to really give me a right old shunt there. It did not. So what's the point of this, then? I wonder if I, like, put that battery on there, then it'll, that'll get shot up in the air. Unfortunately, we'll need a second battery to be able to do that. Scrap metal. And I found another... I found another one. Ooh, I, don't really want, I don't really want to take this downwards. Because if, if it has to go in here and, and I put it down below, then I won't be able to get back up again. So what's that done? That's gone up there. And that's now doing a pushy-pushy thing of its own. Hmm. Can I make this? I can! Huh. Did not expect that. So, that was useful for getting up here, but where was... I can't, I can't get in there, though. Ugh. Oh, hello. Hang on. I can get up here, though. Okay. 
the piss yellow sky up above. I bet it's just like a chum egg. It's, it's one bloody chum egg. Well, finally found the chum egg. <laughs> That's the one I was trying to get earlier. I'm going to try and toss this over to the other side. Now, how far will it th can I throw this? Oh, it's not very far. Oh, that's not going to happen, is it? <laughs> Let's put it on top of here. Nope. Ha! It did not work. Spoiler alert. One of them is down there. One of them is now over here. And this means for the first time I'll be able to place this over behind me somewhere. <laughs> doing something for some reason. I'm sure it'll make sense at some point. Huh. Okay. It's now there. That's not a good place for it to be. I was hoping for it to be... somewhere else, quite frankly. Ugh. Well, that puzzle's proving too time-consuming, so let's actually go to where we're supposed to be going at this point. Uh, which is, for the moment, not marked anywhere. Hang on. We do need to actually rejig our quests, I think. Lightning in a bottle. That one. There we go. Now we're back on the move. We need to go left over here. So apparently if I do this crystal quest, I will eventually get a machinist's badge. And I think we need, only need one more to actually for, for something good to happen. Oh wow, look at this. This is gonna be um This is gonna be a bit difficult to navigate. Oh it's okay. God, look how big that is. There's also a storm cloud building by the looks of it. Look at that. If you can see it through all the um, through all the exhaust fumes. Right, I think we we need to find a way up there. Making a bit of a meal of this, but it should be around here somewhere. I think I, it might just be a case of climbing. I think is I think it's actually um okay yeah I think it's I think it's at the top here rather than somewhere that we can bike our way to. Oh, this is oh this is a climb. Oh game. <laughs> up here, round here. Making ominous noises again. Everything makes ominous noises in this. As if metal is shifting. Is this, is this the plateau? Oh wow, it's yeah, here we go. Oh look at this. This is the this is the, this looks like strong lads all gathered gathered around the campfire. It looks like you I need to talk to. Or you over there. How goes the merchant came in? Oh, I would like to trade with you. I should tell you about the camp first. They don't seem interested in answering my question. I came here years ago, the plateau we called to be studies. Uh, their voice the voice is slow but deliberate and thoughtful. Apparently. Mine in. I would like to trade. See see what we've got here, if anything. Uh, we could buy a black dye to colour the bike. Ooh. Or we can get a top. How much cash have we got? Sixty five quid. We can't get that therefore. We can get some trowel. Um, rubberized to insulate the wear from static charges. I shall get them. Achievement unlocked. Wrapping up, apparently. Hmm. Now, how, how do you actually wear the damn thing? Right, we need... Those are the ones. We're currently wearing black trousers and we can change... Oh, yes, it's kind of like dark blue. Let's go for that. You can't tell in this light, but I think I've, I think I've worn them. At first sight, the crystal farmers are so striking that I nearly gasp. Their height is immense, and they move with such calm that I cannot help but ascribe some higher knowledge to them. How pleasing to hear that she is well. It has been weeks, if not months, since I have seen, d d uh, seen dear Zara. Tell me, Sable, are you on your way to becoming a machinist? I'm considering it. If you do decide to scale that peak, there are few better mentors than Zara. Now then, how may I help you, Sable? Um, how do I harvest the crystals? I was sent to harvest them and asked first if I'm allowed to do that. You're welcome to try. If anyone but Zara had sent you, I would have I would have talked you out of it, but she knows people. So I'll simply tell you, go to the plateau, wait for lightning to strike one of the obelisks, and then break them off. You'll need to be quick about it. All right. I need to harvest three lightning crystals. Presumably from that glowy thing up there where the storm is that we saw earlier. All right, well, we've got our rubberized trowel, and I think that may hopefully help us, given that we're about to be struck by lightning several thousand times. So I apologise again for the screen tearing. I don't think there's a way of turning V-Sync on in this. Oh, look at that. And also, look at that. I see crystals forming. 
Right, I think now we may have to go up here. I'm guessing. Climbed a bit further up. I want to be able to harvest you, but... Oh, <laughs> no such luck, I suspect. Oh, hang on. What's this? Just for a second, I thought that might be a, cl a cloud of some kind. But nope, I'm fine. I think I'm still going up if I'm going this direction. I might have to climb these. They're like sort of transparent in some some respects, but I can climb them. Yeah, this is where I need to go. I think. Although, hang on, no, I, I don't need to go over here at all. I need to go over there. That looks like that looks like the summit I need to be at. I just need to find a way to get up. Oh, here we go. I should be able to climb up here. Ha! At least I found. I already know that I can climb these things. But I am really pushing my stamina. Bricking it, lads! Here we go. Oh, I think we're... Oh, God, look at this! We are at the Crystal Plateau. The very opposite of the Crystal Lake. Oh, wow. Right, so do we climb that tower to the right? It's getting a bit wet down here. Oh, maybe it's just... Uh-oh. What does that mean? Is that about... I think it's about to be struck by lightning. Or it has been already. Hmm. I need three of these buggers. Oh! Did I just miss a... Something? It feels like that up there is exactly what I need. Well, let's try and climb it. God, uh, yeah, I think all these kind of weird wonky bits and bobs are maybe what we need to... Oh god, how do you actually... Well, maybe not, though. I don't know. Oh! It broke. Okay, so those must be the crystals. I just need to wait for them to reform, I guess. Come on, get struck by lightning. Maybe it's gone somewhere else now. Right, everything's going glowy over here at the moment. Oh! Okay. <laughs> Almost got... Oh, there we go, there they are. Right, okay. We, we know we've got... A a bit of a time limit here to try and somehow get up there. But I don't know if I can. Oh, this is... Oh. So what I'm going to do is I'm going I'm to climb the building itself. Uh, I'm going to... Therefore, and then when, when something happens, I can leap into action from wherever I am. High up. So the crystals are currently live over there. So I should be able to get to them... Uh oh, it looks like they're retreating. I'm not sure I can get them. But let's have a go. Well, maybe I can. Look at this. Looks like there's that little one. Oh, it's... No! Oh. Okay. But yeah, it looks like I need to be up in the air over here. Look, there's some more over there. I don't know how... I think we just have to get to the very highest peak, and I think, I think there's just a little one that we can get. I can see how this works. Unfortunately, we do need three of the buggers. I think... Uh, and you have to be very quick as well. Come on, give me what I want, baby. There's lightning. Lightning's getting very... There we go! Right, okay, so we... I'm not... Am I high enough? I'm not sure I am. I don't think I can get up there. Where do I actually jump from, then? I'm... There is nowhere. Damn it. Oh, hang on. Oh, it's really... There's no way of actually... No, you can't climb on the edges. Oh, that's really annoying. This one's so close. Oh my god, look. Get it. Got it. Oh, we can climb on this side. There's another one here. Got it. So as long as you're on the right side, it's all good. Here we go. Please let there be another one up here. I don't actually see another one up here, but... Here we go. Come on. There's another one. Get it. Get it. I got it. <laughs> I can't believe I got them all in one go. It's already gone. Holy shit, the platforms have gone. That was close. That was really... Oh, there's, a... oh, <laughs> there's loads more over there now. It seems like there's quite a few on each one. So that was that was sudden and quick, and I didn't expect to do, actually do it. I thought I was going to be here for another hour. 
um, which I can't afford to do because um, uh, it's Turkey Day and the Mystery Science Theatre 3000 um, marathon is starting in an hour and a quarter. Um, boop. Hello, lads. It was you, wasn't it? Oh. Who am I, who am I taking this to? Mich oh, I've got to go all the way back to Mish. Oh, no. Oh, okay. So it's these lads I'm finished with now. They don't care that I've just successfully got three things with blood, sweat, and tears. No, they, they're just they just there for shits and giggles. Right, so I can go and get my bike, which apparently is now over there. Right, get you. And now we've, we've got to play the long game. Oh, <laughs> the distant game, anyway. Right, so this is going to be... Oh, we're going to have to go past the bloody shadow of Bloody Neve again. Uh, where I completely 100%ed it. <laughs> and you can't tell me otherwise. Yeah, there's nothing like basic log logic puzzles that make you feel particularly thick. <laughs> Especially when you're on camera. Uh, I need to make a bit of a left here. We're nearly back. We're nearly back at the Seven Sisters here on the Victoria Line. And I can just go and find that mate. We never did go and find that poo. Those poo pellets. I suspect that would be this whole thing. Uh, be a whole thing, so not too worried. I need to be able to remember how to actually get back up in the air now. Because this, this station, I seem to remember, is particularly difficult to navigate. You just need to fuck. It's like you just need to spiral upwards in in the way that this game loves to make you do. Get those crystals yet? Yeah. Have I got a story for you? I have them right here. I give her the crystals and she nods approvingly, tossing them around in her hands and inspecting the crackling glow of each one. <coughs> she said. And you got yourself a badge. A machinist badge. What do you intend to do with the crystals? You're like this. I'm building bike parts, and I'm happy to offer them to trade if you've got a mind to make something big, fast, and electric. So this is the lightning stuff. Uh, it costs a lot. 200 quid per pop, and we've only got 15. But this is something we can come back up to. The bike controls and glides their formation to harness the power of each crystal with extreme precision. I get a horrible feeling that there's absolutely shitloads of cool bike stuff in this game that I'm never going to get to see because it's going to require so much time and effort. But this... Look, you can even see the crystals down there now. Ooh. Huh? <gasps> Hang on, we've got three. We have got three. Now I think that means we can do something with it. Here we go, the machinist's mask. I can now go to a mask caster to claim my machinist's badge. Right. Okay, so we've got a choice. We've got a choice of location here. Let's do this. Um, there's one literally just there. There's one here. Hello? Right, you. Yes! The mask cast to sits and moving silent. Claim the machinist's bad madge ma <laughs> whatever. I show my machinist badges to the mask caster. Oh! Crot shot. Unexpected. Right, we're getting a new mask. Progression. Eep. And I claim my prize. Um, let's hope this is not June. <laughs> Ugh. Oh, this is all gooey. Uh, it's all goopy and nasty in there. Ugh. Alright. So. So this is technically, I think, mask number two, because I think you get one right at the start. I also had that funny mask from the, from the previous episode, didn't I? The one, the really weird spotty one. Achievement unlocked the machinist mask. Excellent stuff. Thanks, uh, mysterious tent. Now, um, this is um, this is important. Um, the gliding. This is the main quest line, I think. Um, I found the shade of Equia mask. I should check into a post box. Hello, Sable. Do you recognise my voice? Jaddy, the very sound of her reaches into my chest and curls warmly, cosily around my heart. I'm only kidding with you. One never forgets the voice that first assigned them chores. Hmm. I hope you've been enjoying your gliding and seeing the world at your pace. I expect you've been good and well behaved in your travels. And I hope you've also tried being a little bad. Not rude or unkind, but I hope you've bent a few rules and known the small joys of sneaky little secrets. And plenty of slug cats along the way. Perhaps I've bent some rules once or twice, or perhaps I felt like, just felt like I have. Um, which is, uh, which I think is probably the best part of being a little bad anyway. 
I'll be brief, Sable, because even though my heart could pour itself out for hours, I don't want you standing there too long. We've returned to the Ewer, all of us. Our period of grazing has ended, and we're back precisely where you left us. Though I think a little calmer than we were in those last few days. There is absolutely no rush to return, and if you're having a wonderful time out there, I hope you keep it up. The gliding is yours to extend. But if and when you are ready, know that we are waiting for you with arms that will welcome you regardless of your decision. Now I should go. See you at gliding's end. So, essentially... Um, it looks like we can end the story if we want, or carry on playing, uh, which is a, like a good a good um, cliffhanger to end the episode on. Um, hopefully, so we'll maybe return for more episodes of this because it does seem like people seem to be over time enjoying these the, the previous videos. So it may be a it may be wise having a bit more of a look to this. So see what you think. Um, let me know in the comments and all that. And um, if you're not already a subscriber, do press subscribe and join in with all the best indie games and all that. And I'll see you later. No. <laughs> I almost finished really perfectly there, but no. Anyway, I've got to I've got to go and watch TV.